Hi, I'm Chase Thompson Baugh with Simply Mac, your local source for everything Apple. We're a Utah based Apple specialist with eight stores in Utah, Idaho, and Wyoming. And today we're going to show you some more quick tips on the iPad that I know you're just going to love. And now I'm going to show you how you can get an iPad on or off of mute. So we're going to be talking about the mute switch now, but in my enclosure here, I don't have access to it. So I'm going to go ahead and bring up my personal iPad for just a minute. Now, the mute switch is typically this little switch right up here. So if I flip this on, you'll notice that all of my notification sounds, and for the most part, my application sounds have been muted. So if, for instance, I come in here to my games and go to Angry Birds, you'll notice that you can't hear anything. But as soon as I take that off, So that's what the mute switch is meant to do. It's meant to mute the audio of your applications. It will also mute any kind of uh, notification sounds, whether it be like a notification from your email, or if you have the keyboard click sound, if you type a, a key and it clicks, that sound will also be muted. Now things that it won't work on are things like music. So if I go ahead and tap play, my mute switch is on. But certain applications like the music application or videos, they're meant to play sound. That's their job. So if you wanted to mute those, in essence, you would want to make sure your volume rocker is all the way down. You can see here on the side that that is going down. And now you've essentially muted your iPad. You've made sure that your volume is all the way down, all the way, and that your mute switch is on. That's the way you're going to fully mute it. But if you want to take it off mute, just crank up your volume rocker. And I'll go ahead and uh, turn the music off. It's a great song, I know. And then we'll go ahead and we'll kick the volume rocker, or the uh, mute switch back on. So that's how you're going to bring your iPad off mute. Now, if your switch up here doesn't show this, but maybe shows an icon that looks a little bit like this, this is the rotation lock. What you want to do is come here to settings. You're going to go to general and then come down here and use the side switch for mute. Now you don't have to have that, you can have it on lock rotation. If you do have it on lock rotation, when you come down here, you're gonna get mute instead. Again, I'm Chase Thompson-Baugh with Simply Mac and I've shown you how you can get an iPad on or off of mute.